Hey everyone, what's going on? I am me, you are you, and welcome back to our Minecraft Modded Survival World. And today's episode is going to be kind of short, I'm afraid. Or at least I plan it to be short. Because this is being recorded quite late, because I got home quite late. But that's a story for another episode. So, off camera, I've been laying this run for quite some time. <laughs> like, hours. And if I'm honest, it's not got very far. <laughs> I mean, it's got far, but it's not got a lot of resources. So, yeah, that's unfortunate. But hey, it happens. So, we'll probably just go back to strip mining and let that run as well. Maybe. I don't know, something like that. Anyway, today's episode... I can't speak. Hmm. Ahem. Hmm. <clears throat> today's episode is going to be nice and simple. We what we are doing is creating an extractor. And that is why we needed all the iron. When we actually run the extractor, I'll explain why we needed the iron. We're saving the iron for the extractor, okay? <laughs> That's all you need to know. Basically, you can get byproducts from it, and we need those byproducts to continue work on the reactor. So, yeah, that's that. Anyway, I'll show you what has actually been mined up by the boring machine. Uh, where are we looking? We've got... Oh, some change in my volume. We've got this stuff, which is pretty cool. I mean, pretty cool. You know, 19 diamonds. That's not bad. Almost a stack of iron. And then... If we go ahead and go down here, we've got a whole bunch more ores. I think that's a bunch more anyway. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. Yeah, it's, it's more. It's more. So, anyway, where was I? Ah, yes. Today, we are making an extractor. Nice and simple. So, what we need for the extractor is some things. We need 1, 2, one, two 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. No, wait, no, maybe not, maybe not. Alright, let's just get what we need to get. So we need one of them, one of them. We need a block of wood, a bit of stone. Where's some wood? And then we can get some stone from our very large collection. Throw that in there. And then what do we need? We also need some netherrack, which can be got from there. And then we can get... Hmm... Impeller, so we need 1, 2, 3, 4... 4 plus 6 is 10. So we need 11, 12 action. Okay, so we need 12 steel ingots is what we need. So we'll go ahead and get 12 steel ingots. Yes. Hmm. The iron is up there still. I think rather than uh, grinding it, I think we'll just go straight to, you know, making it. I don't know. Actually, you know what? No, we will grind it so we can triple it. So we got 3, 6, 9, 12. I think I said 12. Yeah. And back down. And then we can go ahead and throw that in the grinder, which isn't being powered right now. Uh, keep talking. No worries, no worries. What we can do is we can put that there, like so. And then we can just swap this to yellow. That's the wrong way around. There we go. So, what I think I will do is... I think I'll just cut here, and then I'll be back once this is all smelted and grinded and turned into ingots. So, yeah. I'll be back then. And we are back with our HSLA steel ingots. Okay, dokie. Now I can get underway. So, we'll go ahead and make this thing. I have lost my voice again. I don't know why. <clears throat> make that thing. And, of course, we're one short. Hmm, interesting, interesting. Okay, we'll be back in a moment. Again. Actually, while I'm waiting for this to smelt, I may as well tell you why this is being recorded so late. So, long story short, I was quite a long way away from home at college. 
and well, no, actually back up a bit. So to get to college, I bike there and back. And today, on my way home, I caught a flat tire. And unfortunately, I caught that flat tire extremely close to college. So I had to walk home with a flat tire in pouring rain. It was not fun. So yeah, that's that. Not fun at all. <laughs> yeah. And for some reason, this doesn't seem to want to go right. So I'll put it in myself. But yeah, that's my long story short of it anyway. There was a lot more detail. Wait a minute, what? Hmm. Hang on. What is this? Okay, I see. There we go. Hooray! The extractor. Just as the sun's setting. Now, how do we power it? Hmm. I reckon we could. We can figure something out. But yeah. So that's the long story short version. As a, as I was about to say, there's a lot more small, minor, unimportant details. But that's basically what happened. So, you know, yeah. Let's see if... Okay. Interesting, interesting. Not enough speed. Before I finish up today's episode, I figured I might as, I may as well try, you know, just see if we can get enough power for it. I know we can with the... I know we can with the hydrokinetic engine, because I have done before. I just need to remember what I used. And I have a feeling it was two 16 to 1s. And jump cut. Hmm. People interrupting and whatnot. Anyway, where was I? Ah, yes, I was right here. Oh, bit of lag. Bit of lag. Hmm, interesting. Completely lost my train of thought now. I remember. Okay, so if we set this to speed mode, and then hook that up, and then put that there. And then set this to up, and then put that there. And then we have enough speed that way. And if we set that up like that, we have enough torque. Okay, that's good. So we can use the extractor now. Off camera, because I say off camera because this method takes a very long amount of time to do what it needs to be done. Yeah, uh, a very long amount of time. Anyway, yeah. So I'll do all the extracting with the iron off camera. So yeah, I think I will wrap it up there for today's episode. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.